Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. If you've been watching the video feed at live.perillo.com over the past week, you may have noticed a red notebook computer sitting on my desk. Indeed, it is an Acer Ferrari 1, part of the 200 series, provided to me by a sponsor, AMD. I have to thank them for that. And the reason why they've offered this as a review unit is, uh, well, this particular notebook computer has something special that most notebook computers don't have yet. I'll be getting into that in just a second. Yes, it is a part of the entire vision program as set forth by AMD, trying to make it easier for consumers to understand if the computer they're about to buy is going to be able to handle the things they want to do. Play some games, get online, maybe do some basic editing, productivity apps. Well, you know me, I'm all about productivity. But for the geeks, yes, this is running Windows 7. It is on top of the AMD M780G chipset, running an AMD Athlon 64 X2 dual-core processor. This is a beefy notebook. It is not a netbook, okay? Netbooks, typically cheap, a little slower, doesn't have enough power. This has got plenty of power, and it is definitely portable, okay? weighing in at about 3.3 pounds. That's portable, right? I mean, you can't fit it in your pocket. But then again, it's a notebook computer. I mean, I've got a, an 11-inch screen. Actually, it's 11.6 inches. And it's a 16 by 9 aspect ratio widescreen. Running 3 gigs of RAM on there, too, by the way. It's got a wireless and networking built in. Of course, I could connect it to a network by way of the gigabit Ethernet. High-definition audio support. 2.5-inch hard drive inside. Uh, it's kind of a given. And, and a, a, an all-in-one. Uh, I, I guess that's kind of a, a loose term. I, I can't say it's going to support all the removable media, but certainly a lot of removable media supported uh, built into the card reader here. Uh, it happens to have a, a six-cell uh, lithium-ion battery which is important. Of course, uh, yeah, I, I always would want to carry a spare with me wherever I went because I hate to run out of power. I'm actually juicing it up right now because I'm going to be heading out with it real soon. So, the reason why AMD has provided this as a review unit, uh, you're going to see this being featured in future videos. Uh, it is running uh, in their Vision ecosystem, but this is why they sent this to me. See this port there? This port is part of their iFinity product. Now, iFinity is going to allow me to connect this particular computer up to three screens. And this computer is going to be able to run those three screens using the iFinity technology. So I'm going to have this screen and then three others. It's going to be sitting right here on this particular desk. And yes, that video is forthcoming. So the reason why that's a big deal, well, think about it. You're at work, you're at school, you, you want to be portable, but you come home, you want a bigger surface, but you don't want to necessarily change computers. So, you could plug it in to three screens using iFinity. And you're thinking, Chris, I've already got multiple monitors. No, 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 no. iFinity is not multiple monitors. Yes, it's, it's multiple monitors, of course, the physical hardware, but the way that AMD has developed it, the software in conjunction with their iFinity hardware, is that Windows is going to treat all of those screens, those multiple screens, as one. An SLS, a single large surface. Which means I don't have to configure anything in my software. I mean, it, it just sees one screen, or an SLS, even though it's multiple monitors. You guys get that? So in gaming, when you want to have the advantage, instead of having a, one small screen, you want to have as much screen real estate as possible, Again, imagine me plugging this computer, this portable computer, powerful enough to run three screens on top of the screen that it's running right now. This is not a netbook. It's kind of an important technology, especially if you're like me. This is one of the reasons AMD reached out to me, because they saw the live video feed. And they said, wow, Chris really gets productivity because I you know, have multiple screens connected to my computer. I need multiple screens. Need! Because once you have a second screen or beyond, you can't go back to one. So, this is the Ferrari that I'm going to be testing in conjunction with iFinity. Stay tuned for that, certainly. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm just kind of in, in love with this kind of... Uh, I just like red. I love red. My favorite color. It's the reason why my, the curtains in my room happen to be red. 
My email address, chris at perillo.com. Feel free to drop me a line, and of course, if you have any questions, that's where you send them off to. And you're also welcome to join us in our community of tech enthusiasts, geeks.perillo.com. Facebook.com slash Chris Perillo is the fan page where we have active conversations happening pretty much all day and all night. And then uh, we also have the live video feed that's uh, you know, happening right now, too. I mean, it's, it's, it's up. And we are typically talking tech. You're more than welcome to join us there in the chat room and be a part of the live video feed. 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Typically talking tech at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.